my channel so today is Saturday September 9th and yeah I just got done doing my makeup my hair and I'm about to go out to dinner about to get dressed y'all I'm gonna show y'all what I'm wearing but right now just chilling you know let me show y'all Riley he over there say hey Riley but anyway we about to Go try something new. <laughs> so I know y'all like why I keep doing my neck and head like this and swinging my hair. But I'm really liking this hairstyle. It's a new look for me. I never tried this kind of look like short middle pop bob. But I love it. These hairs from HairFleet.com. I have a review on some of their hair. I love it. It's, I mean, it's gorgeous. I wash it. Well, shampoo it. Condition. It comes back to life. I curled it today. And it is holding these curls like you know good and I had it curled yesterday and it helped held the curls too so yeah I really like the hair but yeah well make sure you guys watch the review on their hair if you want to know more about it this hair was actually originally long I think like 20 inches but I cut it um, eventually to this look and dyed it jet black well yeah make sure you watch the review if you want to know more because I also have on how I lifted it to a blonde color well I also have the other hair is a blonde color on the other on the other um, video but yeah so I'm about to get dressed for real now and start talking. And yeah, all right, so stay tuned. So let's, let's see what we decide to. Hey guys, so I just finished getting dressed. I'm wearing this little top with jeans and some heels. I'm going to show y'all a better view of my outfit once I go outside. But yeah, we're about to go eat. We're going to Texas Row House. For all right, hi guys, so I'm wearing this outfit. Just these little zipper belt boots. Some jeans, a lace bra top from Fair 21. This little top, I'm not sure where this is from. I think these jeans are from HM and I forgot where the shoes are from. But yeah, just a little cute outfit for dinner. Hope you guys like it. And I'm just carrying my, I think this is Steam Madden. No, this is Stella and Max purse. And it's got some backup shoes in here. But yeah. So guys, I got catfish and fries, and I had a house salad, and look at these drinks, the extra shots. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I got steak, potatoes, and head away. What's happening? Checking in with Glenn by Lovely. It's Ty, aka BC Wave God. Chilling with my dog Zoe, BCMG. Just want to send a shout out. You know what I'm saying? To everybody keeping it real, everybody doing it. So y'all, the word vibe is from Florida, according to him. South Florida. South Florida. And Trumpy means orange. Very orange. Very orange. So if you're from Florida, comment below. Well, I South Florida, comment I just below. Made it up, so don't say Florida said that. <laughs> he's just saying he's made it up. It's funny. Vibe comes from South Florida and Trumpy comes from Thai. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Whole lot of gang shit. Boot game, 1080, BCNG for life. Kill yourself, bitch. You already shouted yourself out. Don't you hate people be shouting themselves out of everything they say? Oh, the lighting is good right here. It's so good. They shout themselves out after everything they say. Hey lovely, so I'm just giving y'all an update on what's going on now. So we left the restaurant. The food was really good. We went to Texas Row House. I think it's like a popular place, probably everywhere. Um, or just about, or maybe just in the south. But yeah, we went there, ate, it was good. So, hmm. My date left his freaking card at the restaurant. So now we got to go all the way back to the restaurant and get the card. And then we're going to go bowling. And that should be fun. So, yeah. And I just changed my shoes to some little, like, sandal type shoes. Just because we have, I'm going to put on bowling socks and bowling shoes anyway at the bowling alley. So, but yeah, we're about to go do that. And we have to go all the way back over there. And we he got a bottle of, I don't know if y'all have heard of this. This is my first time seeing this joint. Let me show y'all what it is. What is it called? What is this called? Do say with the D. So this is y'all probably heard of this. Do say. I drink henny, but we got do say. So we're gonna, you know, turn up on that. But yeah, we about to head out and go back and get the card. <sighs> and then we're about to go to the bowling alley, and that should be fun. But yeah, we about to do that. So see y'all there. Hi guys. So we're at bowling. 
hitting us off and we're about to go inside and go bowling so you guys follow us along to come to the dog park and take Riley out. He is acting a little anti so Phoebe <laughs> anti social and that's another dog out here. It was just two big dogs out here. Well not big dogs but bigger dogs and they didn't like Riley. So I think he's a little shook up from that. No. Hey. Riley! Hey. Sit down. Get your ball! Calm down. Riley's in my purse, guys. We're about to go in here. Hey, how are y'all? Good. Do you need any help? Oh, no. Just getting some treats. Okay. Let me know. Are these dog, like, sodas or something? Uh, it's dog beer, yeah. Dog beer? Yeah. Oh, do they like not it? A, yeah. Not alcoholic, obviously, but yeah. Okay. So cute. So sweet. And it's just... It's snacks. Do you guys have any Halloween costumes? Or is this not yet? Not yet. Um, uh, if we do carry them, it won't be. It'll be closer to like uh, yeah, you know, beginning of October. Oh, okay. We don't do that well with them, so. Oh, okay. We didn't sell a whole oh, this is so cute. This color. Okay. So guys, we just got back from the Dog City Bakery, and I'm about to show you what we got. So, this is a little bag. You put his treats in, and it just says Dog City Bakery and their phone number. I went to the Dog City Bakery. I think this is the second one. This one was on Roswell Road. Alright, and then we also got him a dog beer. Interesting. It's a Browsy with beer. Cockadoodle brew beer is non-alcoholic. She said it's like a chicken broth and it fuzzes when you open it. But I'm about to give him the treat right now. I got him like a donut. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. And then you can see this little bag. And for this I paid let's see. The donut was four dollars. Well they call it a bunt cake. It was four dollars. I guess it's not a donut then, it's a bunk cake, it's four dollars. And this beer was five ninety nine. In total I paid ten seventy six for the time. So this is actually not a donut, it's a bunt cake. Okay, I see because it is it does have a cake consistency. But it's cute. I'm gonna cut it in half and give it to him. It looks like it's made out of peanut butter peanut butter. Oh my god, it smells really good. It smells like like cinnamon. Okay, I hope this steering wheel is not bothering you guys. But so I, I just left from Kroger, you guys, and there was nothing in that damn store. Like people don't wipe this shit out. Like luckily, I was able to get what I needed. I didn't need any water, thankfully, because there was nothing in there. And here's my mom crying. I didn't need any water, so thankfully, because there was not in there. And other than that, it was. 
yeah, just ca a little chaotic. But yeah, then I went to try. To, I wanted to get a flashlight, but that was it. Cause I was like, maybe I should get that, but there's none. So I just got a lighter and I got candles. So that'll do. But yeah, I'll show you guys what I got. I also got pizza for dinner when I get home. So guys, I just got back from the grocery store. And I'm about to just go through what I got and put up my groceries. I couldn't find a flashlight with the Target, um, Dollar General. But I didn't find one. I just want to get one just in case because I'm just worried about my power going out. But other than that, I'm not really worried about the storm. I don't think it's going to be that bad here in Georgia. Um, so yeah. I just got the uh, lighted fit Greek yogurt, vanilla, my day. Just start liking it. These are really good lean pockets. Like that. And then I got some salsa. Some organic yellow corn chips. And that's going to be for my tacos that I'm going to be making. And I got some shredded lettuce. I really like a romaine lettuce, but they really. Like the grocery store so like out there they didn't have that and I'm and I don't mind eating shredded lettuce the iceberg on my taco so I'm just gonna use this and then I got for a snack because I had some strawberries last week and they're really good strawberries um I got some of my favorites which is sunflower seeds I eat these at work to keep me concentrated when I'm working on stuff I know this week at work I have a lot of new things we're gonna be learning I got some of the sun built oats and honey Bars. These are really good. I tried these recently from a friend and they're good. Now, I did see other flavors since I do like those in the store. So, I decided to try the banana oats ones also. These only have 7 grams of sugar. I'm going to try some more, but yeah, I'm going to try those also. And that's pretty much it. I did get one more thing that I have in the freezer. I got these skinny cow ice creams i tried some of their ice cream recently and it was really really good it tastes like regular ice cream i am really try to eat on a healthier side and work out and stuff i did work out this weekend i took my dog out earlier but yeah so i try to work out eating on the healthier side so i got these these have the caramel vanilla and chocolate on the outside and these are only 190 calories 12 grams of sugar that's good for ice cream usually it's like 30 grams of sugar um, 120 120 calories probably per serving. It's just like one scoop or one and a half scoop. Most people eat like three, four. I mean, it depends. Most people eat like three scoops I average, right? I don't know. Or two. So this basically concludes this weekend's vlog. It was pretty cool, pretty fun. Next weekend, my friend's birthday is going, well, my, it's going to be my friend's birthday and i'm ready for the turn up for her we're going to turn up have fun i can't wait to bring you guys along um she should be coming in town friday and she's going to i think she's going to be staying with me so yeah it's going to be fun i can't wait to turn up so make sure you guys stay tuned for the next vlog and it'll be coming up it'll come out hmm her birthday is the 15th, so it'll come out that week after. But yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned for that vlog. But yeah, so thank you for watching, lovelies. You have a, you guys, if you're in Georgia, be safe throughout the storm. Or if you, yeah, but you guys in Georgia, be safe throughout the storm. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and like.